Hi guys, welcome and welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, go ahead and hit that subscribe. So today we have a fun one. We have a colorful July box. I am so excited for this video. Now, this is a little bit different. So this is a twist to this video. Colorful July, I don't know, a little while ago now, it was for Valentine's Day. So this is a February box, a Valentine's Day box. So it was around then. Um, yeah, so they sent it out to me as normal. And I guess just along the way, it got lost in transit. At least that's what we thought. So me and her, my beautiful woman, we spoke and by the looks of logistics and just everything, we really thought that this whole package just got lost in transit. And then one day it literally just showed up at my door. So I'm so excited for this box. But the most exciting exciting part about it is is that so colorful july my beautiful lady got back a hold of me and said okay girl it is what it is the box is not going to show up and so i sent out um the monthly posh box for april <laughs> so now i got two of them the february one showed up we don't know i guess we prayed to the nail gods and it said yes ma'am she's going to go to the right home so it did come to me after all which is amazing but we also have their monthly april box and the posh box so i thought we would just do a big unboxing of both boxes see what we can get into don't forget guys i do have a discount code colorful july you get 15 percent you could save 15 percent on these boxes so make sure you use that blue rose make sure i pop it up somewhere as well and it's always down in the description so what do you think I think let's do the Valentine's Day first. We're a little under, we're a little over Valentine's Day now. We're March, but I'm so happy that it fight came. Like, you know, girl, I was praying to those freaking nail guards. <laughs> like, oh, let that box come, please. Okay, so guys, let's just dig right in to the first uh, box, and this is the Valentine's nail box. So here we go. So pretty. I love their boxes. It's such a nice way for me to decompress. In my personal opinion, it's just a surprise for me. I love it. So I don't go in a cheat and go look. I try not to at least. And here we go. Ooh, this one has been out for a little bit again. This is their, oh my God, you're so cute. Their Valentine's Day box. Okay, so here we go. Let's look. Ooh, love it. Look at that. So that looks like some really nice Mylar. Let's see. Oh, I recall there's been hmm, a beautiful soul looking for some Mylar pieces. Very, very, she wants very fine. Maybe this could be it. Oh, that does look fine, girl. Okay, that does look pretty fine. Don't know if it would just chrome out, but it does look very fine. So there you go. You're looking for some chrome or some chrome flakes that are going to melt right into your nail. Colorful July. And I was looking over there, oh my god, before I started doing the video. I got stuck over there for like 20 minutes. <laughs> I just It's been a minute since I was on the site. And oh my god, they're selling so much stuff individual as well. So you don't have to go for the complete box if you want to just buy something individual. And I think oh, over a certain amount, they got free shipping. They ship worldwide. As far as I looked, it's, it's amazing of what they all have on there. Oh my god, this is adorable too. Okay, we have another one. A beautiful little glitter. This is like a mixed glitter. Ooh, that's pretty. Now that's a glitter. Where the other one, I did feel it was a little bit more flaked out, and I think it will chrome, almost chrome into your nail. And I think that's what she was looking for. But maybe after we swatch, we'll, we'll swatch something in here. We'll try it and see how it does really go. That's really pretty too. Ooh, we have some nice beads. Those are really nice. Some pearls. Oh, no. I see you sticking to the lid. That means they're going to come out everywhere. But this mix sizes. Really, really pretty. And they have like a pearlescent to them. See that? I know, guys. We got flooded with lights today. Sorry. But look at that. It does have a nice little pearlescent to it. Multiple sizes. Oh, so pretty. I'm just setting everything over here to the side. Oh, these are more. Oh, they're the same? I feel like it's kind of the same. Nice. Ooh, another glitter, but this one looks a little bit more glittered. Ooh, careful of those lids. Oh my god. Like you and my glove go so pretty together. It's a beautiful soft pink. I feel like 
I put this stuff. Do you guys remember when I got this stuff? This little lip stuff off of, I think it was Timu a while ago. This stuff's making my lips purple. Ooh, these are some flakes as well, Mylar, but mm, are you? You look a little thicker. And I know what she's talking about. She wants real thin. I know the place, but it's Oh, everybody likes shopping on that place and I think yeah we're gonna see this is a little bit thicker I can tell but that one that I had here I feel like really did this one just is a different so I'm gonna try we'll try it on a swatch and see how it melts if she melts beautifully in the nail then I will definitely throw that link along to her because I know she's been looking for almost melting your mel mouth <laughs> It's stuck um like melt onto it like type of chrome flake is what i know sorry got distracted Ooh, what are these okay so we have some crystals sorry guys my way oh, wow. they're like oh you dangle excuse me miss okay a cute little dangle two of each which i like you get a, that way you can get a set right Ooh, look at that guy and i was you can buy these individual it is crazy i was looking at the different charms that they're selling over a colorful delight guys what are you doing are you not checking them out you better get your butt over there we'll watch the video first then get your butt over there isn't that just gorgeous? Oh my god. I think we've been sleeping on Colorful July. Like, the charms. Look at that. It's so pretty. Let's do some stickers. Ooh, they're so cute. Okay, so we have some hearts. Oh, that's adorable with little Frenchies. Perfect. You know, we can draw our sticker. Oh, I love that again it looks easy like oh that's easy to draw mm-hmm sorry for the cars that is really pretty like little diamonds in there that is so pretty oh my god look at those little hearts adorable and then we're back to those i get my sweet spot Ooh, nice liner That's so pretty. It's gorgeous. Mm. Beautiful glitter. <clears throat> Pardon me. Platinum liner 08. I really want to see what this is because it's Making me very curious. Oh, these are different shapes. Super cool. Look at that. But I like that that they're just in the iridescent. They're not like too in your face. Oh, you got some good stars. Oh, the stars will be so cute. The moons and stars. Oh yeah. That's beautiful. Thank you. Ooh, we have some polishes. Okay, so now we're getting into the big guys. I love their packaging. Like the, this is where I got the inspiration for the bingo boxes, guys. <laughs> for br um for in our facebook group that's it's not just bingo we do for all the little events but uh the treat boxes like the, from colorful july is where i got my inspiration i love their boxes i want everybody to experience them so let's see what this is because i'm so curious oh, it's so cute beautiful that again guys the valentine's day nail box and i seen these on sale so go check it out if you're still interested. They still do have some. I was just on there. But let's jump into the other last few things. I'm so curious to see what this is. Nobody else? Oh yeah, it's like a whole guy I have to put together. They had the one with a bunny one time. I never did it. I wanted to get my mom to do it. And I don't think she ever did it for me. But that's a flower. That is the cutest thing. I think I'm going to want to do it. Got that blue flower. Wouldn't that be so cute for the studio? Just a little cute flower. It actually would go perfect right there. 
we'll have to put it together later. Okay, let me just open up these polishes and then we'll get to swatching. All right guys, so let's go into swatching. Make sure you go ahead and follow Colorful July on all their socials, there you go. Even right here on YouTube, go check them out. Love. Okay, let's get to swatching. So I didn't take a peek. These two look like a nice rose and maybe a dusty rose. Kind of looks like a bit of a dusty blue. So here we go, popular color. Don't ask me to pronounce that. But I've been hearing good things about this brand even um, in the group, so people were saying about I, that was that specific one, or was it that, or yeah, because that was the bottle actually. And is that the same one? Yeah, that's why the bottle was throwing me off. This is the bottle I've been seeing everybody like advertise. I've been seeing a lot of girls advertise that brand, so yeah, it's probably where they're getting it. Ooh, okay, nice. That is like a ow, it's like a um jelly, but I would say. I think they're really trying to mimic like a nude natural skin tone vibe and I'm not hating that at all. That is gorgeous. Should we give her a little swatch? Beautiful. So we'll do two coats. Of course I gotta get a, um, whatchamacallit. A fuzzy. Wow, it's not so pretty. So it's definitely a jelly consistency. Oh, it's right there at the top. Oh my God. Why didn't we tell me that? So G013, I was trying to see what it says on that. I don't know, something polished. Oh, that's what it was. Ooh, okay, so G092. Girl, long down the top of the bottle. G092. Ooh, okay, so this one's definitely a lot more opaque where the other one was more of a jelly. I was not expecting that. Oh my god. Oh my god. You look like gorgeous. Okay. Let's see. Why well, do I gotta get a fuzzy every time? I just wiped you. God, got melt into itself. Self levels beautifully. Fuzzy and all. I see you, I'm not taking you out. Nope, too bad. <laughs> I don't get it, like, take it, wipe my swatch stick. And I'll still get a fuzzy. Okay, here we go. So this is 002. Again, the bottles are beautiful. 15 mil bottles. You know we like in the big size. I think everybody is over the baby guys, but I get why they do it. Excuse you. Holy. We need a moment for this guy. Hello, gorgeous. This seems almost like, it's almost giving me a, like a whitey, but a little gold. But now I don't know if it's the handle. So I think we're gonna have to, oh, see, we're gonna swatch her. Gorgeous. Okay, it's just giving me more white, but I, f I feel like, I don't know. We're gonna do a couple coats of that though. Let's do one more coat of this G, G092. Oh my God, guys, look at this color. If this isn't gonna be just like the most gorgeous nude, I think for honestly, like any skin tone. I think for my s s paler self, this will give me a little something. Two pinks, I look too washed out. Um, and then for a darker complexion, I do feel that'll look nice too. Well, that doesn't really show my arm, I guess. I was probably more tander, tander, tanner, than the rest of my body. The jelly again, I do wanna just do one more. So GO13. Oh God, yeah, that's it. 
That's a sweet spot right there. And that's okay. I'm not scared of three coats. When you have a beautiful formula, and this is very, I can feel it, it's a thin formula when it comes to this jelly, which is you're gonna want when you have a jelly because if it's thick, you're gonna get bulk, right? You want your jelliness, uh, but you need to layer that up to get it just to be beautiful in my opinion. Like, look at that, gorgeous, no bulk. Okay, so let's put the lid back on these two beauties. Again, guys, G013, that is so beautiful, but I'm not lying to you. Go grab G092. I'm going to set that down for one second. Oh, my God. And when I tell you, it is like one of the most gorgeous nudes. You, oh, you will not be disappointed. There you go. Oh, that's just so pretty. Mm. Love. So happy to have that thank you so much okay can we go back on let's go again this is 002 the handle is really nice on this too oh my god isn't that gorgeous so let's put it under a white it does though, it almost has a slight little bit of yellowiness, right? Like it's like a champagne-y, that's what I'm feeling. It's giving me a champagne-y vibe, not as much as a clear or like a white, it's more champagne-y. So it does have that hue, but ooh, she is pretty. Go in there and play. Again, that was a 002, very nice bottle. Nice long handle. Very nice. They're very beautiful bottles. All of them. Is that 15 as well? Doesn't really say. Gorgeous. Okay, guys. So we have a two here. Here's a beautiful 07. It's like a mauve color. Look at that. I knew you weren't going to do justice on camera. It's a little bit more purple in personal, but it's definitely like that muted type of vibe. I don't I want to say muddy. I don't know why. Is there a better word? There has to be a better word. Oh, it's beautiful. Let's give her a quick swatch, shall we? Oh, okay. Beautiful. Give it a second or two, a self level, and then we will pop that in the light. Give this one a second coat. Oh my god, this is a beautiful color, too. Look at that. Gorgeous. It's like a purpley brownie like mauvey color i don't mauvey maybe that might be let's call it that all right guys that's in the light top coated now last but certainly not least for the valentine's day box this is number 80 now are you ready for it i don't think you're ready for it i was not ready for it i told you you weren't ready for it i don't know i thought that was blue or something but I know, I know. Throw that in there too. 81, uh, GO92, oh, 002, you're gonna need that one too. Oh, check some of those. Let's check some of those glitters. Okay, Whew. I do wanna check, what was it, this, this glitter. So let me put this in my face so I check it. <laughs> Let's just give this one a quick swatch. Oh my God, guys, like I was not ready for that at all. <laughs> She's gorgeous. Now, I do believe this is a style of gel paint that you would probably use a little bit more for accents and line work. Oh, yeah. But I'm going to show you what you can do if you want, because that's your business if you want to do full cover. But this actually down a full cover and then do full cover bling would be perfect. 
or we, especially anything with a high glitter. You want to be thinner as well. So we'll do two coats to that. That is like the most gorgeous silver, 81. Oh my God. So I do want to see something. So there's no top coat. I already top coated it though, so unfortunately. So let me see something. I think this might be a little bit more of a glitter than a flake is what we were trying to hope for, but let's see. Oh no. Oh no, girl, we're in business. I think we're in business. I think that's what you're looking for. So you do like, so this is like definitely get contact. Oh my God, you just like turned that into something crazy. So this is not a chrome, it's like chrome, I don't know how to describe this the best way. I might not do the best job, I'm sorry, Colorful July, or product, um, but I'm gonna do the best of my ability. So what I would describe this as, it's kind of like you get, it's a glitter, like a glitter shards, pieces of like shard glitter, but it almost melts into your nail like a chrome. That's why I always call it like a chrome effect to it, but they have to be the most thin glitter it won't work with thicker glitter like some of that does look a little thick but it is actually laying down quite nicely like I don't know how all the big pieces will because you want it to melt into your nail so you could just put it on with your finger literally top coat it and go type of vibe and I do feel that that does do that okay so there we go it definitely just melted right into the top coat, actually. So you are getting effect. It's not bad on that color, but. Okay. That was a beautiful color. So that is what I wanted to see, and it really does. It just melts in. So, colorful July. Got your back. All right, let's do one more coat on this gorgeous silver, number 81. Oh my goodness. You're gorgeous. You're just gorgeous. Beautiful. All right, guys, look at those beautiful colors. Oh my God, again, one of my faves. That silver, absolutely gorgeous. And I do love that color. I don't know if I like how it looks with the glitter over top of it, but I love that the glitter melts into it. That's exactly what I wanted to see if it did. So that's so pretty. I do enjoy that. I just don't know if the yellow is throwing me off a little. Because a yellowy almost. But then it's like a champagne-y. I don't, it could be because beside these colors, it's just almost giving me a yellow, but by itself it gives me like the champagne vibe, if that makes sense. All right, guys, so that is it. That was all that was in the Valentine's Day box. So why don't we just jump right in and let's jump into the monthly posh box, shall we? All right, guys, so this is the monthly posh box for April. Ooh, I'm so excited for this one because April spring vibes. Okay, what are we going to get into? So again, we have their socials. Make sure you go check them out, follow them on all their socials, Colorful July. There you go. Love. I love their little cards. Are you ready? Look, look at that paper though. Like it just melts my heart. And this is why it's so fun. Like just imagine yourself getting this every month as just a beautiful gift to yourself. Oh my God, guys. Like I personally, I know I'm growing, but it feels nice to just do a little something for myself and have a little something for me and it's special and it's kind of a surprise and it's fun. I love them. I just love them so much. They give me so much joy. So this is again the April Posh. Look at the stickers. I'm going right for the stickers. Oh my God, look at these foils. <gasps> that is so cute. Okay, stickers first. Look, oh my God, I love them. My little textiles. Oh, they're so pretty. Love them. Oh, I really enjoy the colors of that. The like the bluey green with the yellow. Oh, it's like a nice little mint. The white. Oh, such unique colors. Oh, little Hello Kitties. 
Those are just cute. Ooh, and then we have some nice Easter ones. I love these. I actually already have these and I am so glad to have a second pack because I was looking to try to find the eggs and I couldn't didn't know where to find them again. And look, it was Colorful July that I got them from. Now I know, now I can go get more. Well, I'm glad to have an extra one, but I probably want more. So I'll get them for next year. Let's go back on the site. Ooh, this is like a heart mold. Ooh, ooh, that's cool. That's nice and deep. Look at that. Okay. I have to like try them. I've only ever tried it once or twice, but these are like some good molds. My molds weren't deep at all. These are nice and deep. Okay. That's probably why it never worked the first time I tried it. <laughs> probably need good molds, so that's cool to have. Oh my god, look at these little flowers. These are so perfect for spring. Oh my god, right? Oh, look at that little case too. I'm scared to open it. Beautiful little flowers though. Got a good little variety and you could just pick them apart and then encapsulate them in the nail. Amazing to have. Ooh, treats. Where do I want to go? I kind of want to go here. Oh my God. I feel like, ooh, a beautiful little liner. Look at that loud cars, right? Oh, a nail paint pad, okay. It's light. It is a little light, but I like the length. It's a nice length. I like my brush to sit in my in my little cove there. Okay, that's nice. Beautiful little liner. I see another one. Oh my god, there's a few in here. Okay. Again, a nail pen, a nail pen. So they don't, oh, maybe they do, but they don't say it. Oh, that's so cool. Put that back here. Okay, so this one fits here. We have a nice little liner. Oh, sorry guys. There we go. So yeah, this one is a little thing, but it's okay. And this one is like a gel brush. Oh. Again, good length. Lighter though. They are a bit lighter. Some of the lids fit really well. Like these ones fit really tight. I don't know. This might just be a lemon. Like, so that happens in life. It's okay. Okay. Ooh. We have some, it looks a bit purple or white. Maybe those little jelly gels. We'll have to look, swatch them a little. Ooh, I see crystals. These. Oh my God. They're so pretty. A good little multi-pack, all different colors, which I love. Ooh, what's this? Oh, it's a little dampen dish. That is so cute. I love that. I love little dishes. I have like two, okay, three drawers. <laughs> I was gonna lie to y'all and say I only have two drawers. I have like three drawers full of just little dishes that I like to collect and that. So this is just so cute. And it's like pink. It goes with my color scheme, pink and blue. So I love that. Ooh, that is so cute, a little cute damping dish. Okay, so we have some gels and then we have some foils, which I need to get better on foils. Some nice Easter foils. Ooh, this one's unique. Ooh. Those colors are so cool. We get a small piece there. Okay. Again, you do need a specific type of glue as far as I know. I don't know how to get them attached any other way besides foil glue. So you are gonna wanna grab some of that. You get so many different ones. Look at that though. It looks like each one has a couple. Wow. So you don't get a long strand, but you get a lot of variety. So that's pretty cool. Oh, look at those ones. That's really pretty. The bun buns. Okay. 
So let me just take the gels out, get them all out of the packages, and then we'll come back and we'll give them a quick swatch. All right, guys, so I went ahead and I took everything out. Let's just go ahead and swatch these two little guys. So this is 12. Looks like a purple. Oh, yeah. I love these things. You can make so many cool little things from them. It's easy applicator because it already has a little tip. Oh, those little um, animal balloons. I've been seeing them everywhere. I'm like, oh, I feel like we could make them, right? What is this guy? Oh, are you clear? Oh, you're clear. I'm trying to do an animal balloon. <laughs> I don't think we did it good. Kind of legs. It could work. Isn't that like the funnest things? This is a clear though. So that's cool though. Oh, I want to, I always want to play. Like honestly, every time I get these boxes, it just makes me want to play and have fun. And I think that's like the main thing I love about like getting the colorful July boxes is that it lets me be fun and be creative and not have to stress about all the specifics. I could take all the goodies in the box and just enjoy and play with them. And I love that. Sometimes that's what I need in life. It's just a good old play. So GO39. Ooh, okay. That's a very unique color. I'm getting almost olive-y, olive-y, but like a creamy. Nice. Oh my god. Yeah, that's nice. Nice, like, thick consistency. Well, I'd give it a medium consistency. It's not too thick. It self-levels nice. But it's not thin either, which... I do prefer. Oh, that's gorgeous. Isn't that such a unique, pretty color? We'll do two coats. Get that one in there. Now, let's go over to G24. Ooh. That's another good one, too. Okay. Wow. These are like beautiful nude colors, very all time, like all seasons. I'm gonna say all year round. Oh yeah, that's nice. Even with the fuzzy. Come on. Okay. And then this one as well. That's a beautiful light creamy brown. Almost coffee vibes. Okay, we'll quickly go back and just do our second coats. Mm. It's, it's beautiful. Like what? What? What can you say? What can you say? Oh, that's a good color. Very unique color. I got something on my swatch. Okay, we're just gonna go ahead and do a second coat. And that's where you get like your perfect coverage. Two coat system, which you always should be doing two thin layers over one thick layer anyways. But when it just, you just see the perfect coverage, it melt into itself, you know it's a good polish. Oh, that's nice. And like I said, the fuzzies, no, they're not included, but when I paint nails, there's fuzzies. <laughs> so in my studio, fuzzies included. <laughs> I don't know why, even if I wipe them. It's just weird, guys. It's okay. Beautiful. Those are really beautiful colors. Again, GO24 and GO39. The 39 is a very unique color. Mm, that'd be a good uh, addition to any collection. Very, very pretty. Okay, so let's go to these two. Mowbray can read them five mils 42 and 45 these are some cute little bottles okay so let's try 42 first oh well hello miss oh. okay wasn't expecting that I didn't know what to expect I guess Oh, that's nice. Oh, it glides so nice. 
Okay, it is a bit of a thinner compared to the polish we just did. But oh my god, the glitter is so fine in there. We'll do two coats. Let's check this one out. So this is 45. Ooh, that one's nice too. It's like a silvery blue. Ooh, gorgeous. Again, it is a little bit on the thinner consistency, but the coverage is like this beautiful coverage. And the glitter is so fine. You definitely won't have to worry about filing any of that. But I do believe it's a two-coater. Let's go back and give that beautiful purple one more coat. Again, you're always better with two thin layers rather than one thick. But you can feel that that formula is a little bit thinner, but it lays beautifully. Gray coverage, two coats. And that's how I'm going to judge a polish. Not off one coat. Oof, not streaky. Pretty. Okay, let me get that second coat on this blue. Ooh, that blue's so nice. I want to see what it'd look like with a third coat, too. I think a third coat might finish it off beautifully. But I think you could get away with two coats if you didn't want to third coat it. Oh, yes, that is gorgeous. I think we'll do three just to see. Okay, we have two coats on the purple, which I do believe like that is perfect coverage. Nice thin layer, but if you want it to go a little darker, and again, I think that's what it's going to do. It's going to darken it up just a little bit. Yeah, just a smidge. But it doesn't bulk out the nail because, oh, sorry, because the formula isn't a very thick formula. Now, if that was thick and the same full glitter, I don't know if I would, I honestly don't know if I would recommend it as much. But being like that, I actually think it's a lot easier to work with. Go on. Beautiful. And that glitter is such a fine shimmer and that's where you're getting your color. And that's why, I believe why they probably would do it as thin as they did. So you get that. So let's do these two guys. I didn't know really what they were, right? Well, mine was a polish, solid polish, but it doesn't really give you a color. They look pretty similar, like the jars, I'm not. Oh, there's a number. This is five underneath, but there's no number on this guy, so. Oh, well, that wasn't a good surprise. Oh, but look at that. These are like, they're giving me metal effect. That's where I'm going with that gel. Yeah, that's a metal effect gel all day long. But look at that go on. Oh, my God. Holy. That's beautiful. Oh, there we go. Is that not incredible? Holy. So that is giving me metal effect. It doesn't say it on the pot, but that's what she's giving me. So I'm going to go in with the second one. And again, the same vibe. This one is just a silver. And that little bit of streaking, guys, that's my brush. Let me work my brush. If you work the product in your brush, you won't get that. But because I just wiped the blue off, see the difference? Fuzzy. Why do you gotta come to the program? But it's not so pretty. I can go a little thicker now, but like... I could play with this forever. It just is so cool. That is like a truly incredible. That's a silver. Woo! Metal silver. Again, we can go a second layer with the blue. Okay, we'll just let those two cure. We'll move on to the two. We have two final guys here. This is 44. Canned solid rubber. Oh my god. That is like... I want to get blue jean, but like a little light blue jean. It, it is a little bit on the lighter side. It's showing up a little darker on camera, but ooh, that blue looks so pretty. Oh, 
Oh, not perfect coverage. I love the blue. Like, what, what? There's nothing to say about you. You're gorgeous. Oh, beautiful. We'll do two coats as usual. Okay, last but certainly not least, thank you for focusing. We have a 17. And this looks like a really, it's coming up lighter in person, a little darker on camera. But it's giving me like coffee, cream and coffee. Like creamer in coffee, which is a beautiful, beautiful color. Absolutely loving that. I've been in like a mocha vibe and I got some beautiful charms in that have like a mocha color. I'm going to go really nice with this. Okay, beautiful. And I'm just going to want to go ahead and just kind of wipe off my brush a little bit better because let's keep it real. There's still blue paint in that. Okay, let's try that again. Oh yeah, that's like a beautiful caramelly coffee color. It's giving me coffee. I don't know why. Coffee creamer. Hmm. Making me want a cup of coffee. It is a bit of a jelly though, so I can already tell we're going to have to build this up to get a little bit of the opaqueness. So we'll just do one thin layer. Oh, that's so pretty though. Okay. Pop that in the light. Okay, let's just go ahead and give a second coat. Okay, so we're just going to go in and give this a spinal coat. I personally would like give this three and then yeah you get your perfect coverage which is still a little bit translucent but, oh my god look at that well, that beautiful like it giving me coffee cream what is it giving you let me know in the comments below definitely giving me like coffee cream vibes okay put that in the light we're gonna top coat that and then we'll just go over all of our colors that we have all right guys look at this look at all these colors they're so pretty but the metal effects oh my god are a mess the glitters so pretty i don't know i'm personally loving all these ones though i think this box in general the whole box is a beautiful box and i don't think you'll go wrong getting the whole posh box for april because look at all the colors this is such a unique it's giving me like creamy-ish vibes but like a little green i don't know like an olivey i don't you know i'm terrible at describing colors but it's beautiful and I think it'd be a great addition to any collection. I'm so happy. So guys, let's go over and just recap all of the goodies that we got for both boxes. Remember, we got in the Valentine's Day box and we also got in the April Posh box. Oh my God, guys, look at all this stuff. I can't believe it. This is definitely my biggest Colorful July unboxing ever. I'm so grateful. Thank you so much. Definitely get the April Posh box, but check out the Valentine's Day. If you can get it on sale, it's definitely worth it for the polishes and decals alone. And then the little flower is so cute. Okay, just grab that one too. I'm sorry, but if you can and get it discounted, make sure you use my discount code. That'll help save you guys 15%. Thank you guys so much. Make sure you give it a thumbs up, hit that subscribe, share with a friend. See you in the next one. Bye guys.